Hey y'all, welcome back to Jackie's World. Happy Monday to you. Happy President's Day, y'all. So, y'all, I wanted to come on here and do a quick video. You know what I was thinking about? I was thinking about I had left that Valentine's Day candy. I had all this Valentine's Day candy that I bought for no reason. Okay, so, because my kids, they ain't even never, they seen it on the table, they ain't even never fooled with it. But you know they grown anyway. So, um, if my voice sound a little weird, I'm a little under the weather, y'all. That cold bug trying to get me. You understand what I'm saying? So if I sound nasally or my throat sound weird, just keep on rolling with me, okay? So look, I was watching videos today on YouTube and last night trying to figure out a video to do with leftover Valentine's Day candy. Like, you know, even though it's from the dollar store, I don't want to waste my money. So I decided to um, do the Julia Pachanko one. She did one called the um the s'mores dump cake. Okay, so we're doing a dump cake today. Now, this might not be a s'mores one, this might be like a uh Valentine's Day candy mixed up, uh mocha mocha mess. I don't know, but we're gonna try it, okay? So I'm gonna do exactly what she did, except my ingredients is not exactly the same. She used all chocolate, chocolate, chocolate on everything. I don't have chocolate cake mix, I have vanilla. But let's go ahead and want to get into it. You ready for it to do it? Let's do it. Remember uh, <laughs> that song, Let's Do It. It was a tone look, y'all. But anyway, um, so I had bought a pan from the dollar store yesterday. Y'all, and I got in the dollar store. I'm getting my spray. Because you got to spray your pan. Because here I go with a story. Got in the dollar store yesterday. It was only going to get mouthwash and saw some Easter stuff. It was so cute, y'all. But I ain't gonna show it today because it's too early. It's too early. Okay, so what she started off with was um the pudding mix. All I got was vanilla, um, vanilla cream, banana cream that I've been had. So she had chocolate pudding mix. But guess what? I ain't going to store for no money. Let's just roll what we got in the kitchen. Okay. Trial and error today. Hello, baby. Trial and error today. All right, so we're going to start like she did with the, um, the pudding mix. Okay. Spread it around. And she put, um, so maybe I should admit this part, but I'm going to go with it because that's what she had. She put hot chocolate mix in with hers. Okay. So we're going to go with the hot chocolate mix too. Because I don't even drink it, y'all. Then she did chocolate cake mix. But that's, this is what I had. The white cake mix or half of the box of the vanilla. And I'm like, we're just going to go with this. And we got to figure out what the name, what's, what's the name going to be. Okay. I don't, I don't even know what it's going to be. But it was just the simplest um dump cake that I like that. I said, oh, that's the simplest dump cake I done seen. That's the simplest one I done seen in a minute. Because I was really looking for one that had to deal with candies, you know. To deal with the candy. We'll set that away. All right. So, we're going to stir this around. And she said, you put one and one-fourth cup of milk. So, y'all know I can only drink almond milk. I got my almond milk already ready. And I'm getting my whisk out. Okay. And I wish more people would make videos with the leftover candy. I seen somewhere you taking, um, you know, like, put it on a pot. Get a pot with some water, put it on the stove, get that nice and hot, and then you take a bowl, which I don't have a no plastic bowl. I mean, not plastic, glass bowl. Put the chocolate in it and melt the chocolate down to make, um, you know, like brownie or something like that. to use this whisk on y'all what make me want to use this whisk i don't know i'm not sure if she used 
a whisk or not. That's what I did for trying to get up in here real quick and do this here. How you do that there? Okay, let me get my little spatula. We're gonna get our little spatula out. See if that's better. Y'all, I don't know how I got that sore throat. Like, it just came on all of a sudden on Saturday. Like, all of a sudden, I had a sore throat. And I was like, oh, no. Y'all be eating garlic and everything. I smell like a garlic bag and everything. All right, I'm still trying to mix it up a little bit more. Look like that white flour I ain't even trying to mix up in there right. Okay, and it's supposed to be gooey like this. This is how I heard it was. But I'm still trying to mix mine up a little bit. What if I need some more milk? Do we need a little bit more milk? Wait a minute, y'all. Let's let's put a little teeny bit more milk. She said one and one fourth cup, and we I did the one and one fourth cup. I measured that out and everything. We just add a little bit more to it to get make sure we get it stirred around in there right. Hello, can y'all see everything we're doing? And I know I don't have the good camera set up like everybody else. Well, you could just be right down on the food. Hey, y'all. Y'all know I'm using my phone. Y'all know. Okay, so what I did while I'm doing this, while I'm still trying to mix this up a little bit more, I took some of the, um, the Valentine candy I had and I blended it up in the little chocolate thingy with some of those pretzels. You see the pretzels sitting up there? Those uh, white fudge pretzels and the chocolate fudge pretzels. And I'm going to put them on top. So she put on top of hers um, like chocolate chips or whatever. I'm not going to put chocolate chips on top of mine. I'm going to put that on top of mine. And she said you bake it at 350 for um, 35 minutes. I guess it's like a fudge, kind of like a fudge, I guess. We're going to see. Did I make a fudge best, y'all? I don't know. I'm still trying to get the flour to, um, to blend up in there right. Gee whiz, let me taste a little bit of it. Tastes like banana. Banana something, I don't know. Banana cream pie. And I still feel like mine didn't, um, like I still, oh, that's marshmallows right there. Mm. Cause I had marshmallows in my, my cocoa mix. All right, we're going to let this fly. We're going to let that roll. We're going to get this together. It's over. Because I'm tired of mixing that up now. It's over. All right, y'all. So, I'm going to take the, um, and I had some of the chocolate hearts. I'm going to show you that I had in the back. If I can get it to come off of there, y'all. I'm going to get it. There we go. There we go. There we go. So I'm bringing it up a little bit closer so y'all can see what I'm talking about. You know, I use this and I chop it up in hand. So just so you see what it look like. Chocolate covered pretzels. All right, chocolate. Okay. And I use just two of these. Lay it up in there together. Because I was going to use the dollar store chocolate, the real chocolate. Y'all, but when I broke this thing open, it had some kind of nasty orange cream in the middle. I was like, we ain't doing that. So I don't know what the ones had chocolate or whatever, but it's okay. 
we just gonna sprinkle this around on there. So it's pretzel topping with chocolate topping. So this lady be tripping. And there it is. We're gonna put it in the oven like she said for 35 minutes and see what it be like. See what it do. All right. All right, all right, all right. Let me put the time on and stop back down. Let's put 35 minutes on there. And we're going to see what it be like, what it tastes like. Thank you for coming and watching for me today. Keep still. All right, y'all. So I let it cool off for a while. It's not looking all that great, but we're going to taste it. I got some Cool Whip on the tape. Bring it up there so y'all can see it's looking crazy. <laughs> But it's all right. It's all right. All right. All right, y'all. And I see I got a couple of new subscribers. Thank you. Welcome in. Sometimes I don't say nothing about it because, you know, people subscribe, then they unsubscribe. But, y'all, this is just a little, um, I don't want that big a piece. A little crazy bacon channel. It's really like, um. Let me not even say bacon channel. Let me say um, it's just for fun. Just for fun. So, and entertainment, stress, and to relieve stress, okay? Let's get my little plate. Ooh, 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 ooh. Y'all, so it look okay. We don't know. But you know what? Let's get some, um, let's put a little cool whip on it. Let's try it with a little cool whip. Ooh, we. Ooh-wee, baby. Ooh-wee. Don't you want to take me on a sea cruise? I think that's how it go. Don't think of the song, y'all. I don't know. Sometimes I be tripping. She done made a, um, y'all, I'm still trying to think of the name for the Doug on cake. It was a, uh, the white classic cake mix with the, um, Banana cream and some uh, what else, y'all? Some hot cocoa mix with some Valentine Day candy mixed up, mixy, messy, maxi mess. <laughs> y'all, it tastes okay. Tastes like I don't know. It tastes alright. Wish you could taste some. Tastes okay. Just something crazy. Ooey gooey crazy. Just a, a leftover Valentine's Day surprise. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. Anyway. I thank y'all for stopping by. I thank you for commenting, liking, and subscribing. And I hope your day went also oh well. A different Monday, a different week. If those of us who were off got to relax today, okay, and hoping everybody feeling well with all this stuff going on. Anyway, hope you had fun. Even though it was something that I can't wait at the last minute, keep commenting, and keep liking and subscribing, and keep on coming back and joining the girl. And I'll see y'all next time on Jackie's World. Bye.